Okay, guys, this is Dungeon Master 201, continuing our playthrough of... Oh, what the hell is that? Our playthrough of Sacred Stone's Fire Emblem. And this is Chapter 3, The Bandits of Borgo. Local villagers told me that Bazba's band is keep their lair nearby. A few of them saw matching, uh, saw a lad matching description of a bracelet thief and yada yada. Alright, so basically we are going to see about getting Ross a little bit of experience. Because Ross is in dire need of experience. And we're going to move some of our guys up a bit. And we're going to move Erica up. And we're going to move you there. You are going to... We're going to slowly move our people up. And you can just go do whatever it is that you want. And looking over the board, looks like there's a thief here. And... Uh, Chest key, nanny toxin. Okay. Now we're gonna bring an end of this round. And it looks like they do nothing. Absolutely nothing. They just sit there. So let's go ahead and bring Nimi and have him talk to our little new friend here. And he joins you. And we're going to see about giving him a little bit more experience. Because he is in dire need of experience. And we're going to bring him up. We're going to leave that there because... No, he can't do anything. Okay. And uh, we're going to bring the rest of our team up a little. Because all that thing can do is just pretty much sit there and, well, die. Because for whatever reason, he doesn't feel like moving. And you can go do whatever. I don't care. Bring an end to that. And let Ross get a little bit more experience. Ah, oh, you missed! That's not good. Now we're gonna bring Erica up a little and bring you there. Oh, it hit! Let's see, can you hit this time, Ross? Good. And he's now a level two. Oh, he has a better hit chance now. Every time your skill goes up, that means your hit ratio increases by about two percent. And we looks like we have some keys or some chests to open. And let us bring our healer up and heal you. And so bring the rest of my team up. do whatever you like. Alright, Ross, let's see. Can we get you a little bit more experience, please? Oh, come on. Really, Ross? You're gonna miss? Now we're gonna open up some chests. And we got ourselves an iron sword. And Ross 
let's get you a little bit more experience. Will you please hit this thing? Good, now we just need you to hit next time and we could uh, get you some more experience. These guys will just sit around all day, really. And it's like, eh, we're too brave to uh, do anything. <laughs> Come on, Ross, time to get some experience. You weak little bastard. Ross is a journeyman, and he doesn't really gain too much uh, experience. Let's see, rescue. And we're gonna bring you there. See about you getting some experience at the same time. Ooh, wow, support. Now, whenever characters have the support option and they're near each other, uh, they gain various bonuses depending on their affinity signs. Uh, let me go. Where is it? They have these little signs here. As you can see right here, the affinity signs, and depending on the affinity sign uh, compatibility, they do certain different things. And we're going to go ahead and bring an end to this. And where is the healer? Hmm, I don't like this at all, so I'm going to... Wait, and bring you down. Wait, and we're going to bring you a little bit closer. And bring the rest of our guys up. You slow. And yeah, we're gonna bring an end to. You know what? No, no. I'm gonna bring you closer down this way. some healing. Oh, wait, my stealing is full? Really? What can I steal? Oh, a chest key. That might come in handy. So we're going to go ahead and kill him, but it, whenever you see, uh, look at an uh, opponent's uh, inventory, if it's glowing like uh, the chess key was, you'll automatically get it. But if you can steal it, you'll gain 10 experience points for doing so. And uh, this is a, uh, in this Fire Emblem game, all you have to do is have an uh, item be sent home. Uh, did I open that? No, I didn't. I'm bad on me. Okay, and have Erica get the key from him. And she's gonna have to wait.
Alright, good, good. With this level, you really can take your time. And we get ourselves a javelin. Another item we can send to inventory. And it looks like uh, the bond between Nimi and Colm is plus one to or greater attack. And our speed has increased. How nice. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and heal up. And we're going to bring Ross down. Whoops, there we go. Damn it! And bring you back up. And we don't want to do that. We'll go ahead and open the door. Okay, I thought it was gonna try and like move some of your guy, move some of the people around a bit. All right. What is this thing's range? It's quite a range. I want uh, my Ross to have some experience. So we're going to have it attack this thing. Okay. Let's see what happens. And that. Oh, damn, a hit! Retreat! Wow, that was close. I only got luck in a one hit point. Oh no! Oh, that thing is faster than Ross, that's not good. We need to get you out of there. Was close. I almost lost uh, our journeyman there. We're gonna move you out of the way since I don't know how strong uh, or how the difference is between the two. For all I know is that Erica can kick some ass. Justice for injuring my guy. Alright. And we got two more to deal with. And once again, the goal of this level is to capture the throne. And that is an Iron Lance. So we got some weapons. We're going to move you up, and we need to move our healer up. are now at level 9. That's, some, that's good, because Erica needs some defense. Alright. We're going to go ahead and we're going to heal Erica. And she's now using a steel sword. I 
better let him attack and be on the defense. I'm the head of this bandit pack, the mighty Bosba. Hope you enjoyed life, cause it's about to end. We're gonna let him, uh... Cause that's what uh, is what I was kind of afraid of. Cause if I, that thing, all that thing has to do is hit me twice, and it's over. Gained a better weapon level. Yes, it is. And you've been defeated, and I'm now a level 10. And now we can end this. And those two reunite. And we brought an end to this chapter. The next one I'll be going to... Zaha Woods.